SH International Church brings you Life Simmons teaching healing and deliverance with Pastor Tinash and Ole Guru Pira. We are KSH International Church. What a great and um, a blessed morning. A blessed morning, family. Be greeted where you are. We thank the Lord for this wonderful time in the presence of the Lord. I want you just to tell somebody that we are about to pray. I want you to tell somebody that we are seeking the face of the Lord. Midnight it is as we are praying, as we are saying, Jehovah, all that we need is you. I want you to share this broadcast. Just tell somebody. Share this broadcast. Tell somebody that we are about to pray. We thank the Lord for his grace. 12 midnight. It is midnight. I want us to seek the face of the Lord. Right now, I want you just to rise up where you are. Just rise up where you are. We want to praise the Lord. We want to worship the Lord. I want you to do it with your own understanding, in your own understanding. Father, we worship your name and we glorify your name. Open your mouth, somebody. We give you glory and honor. We magnify your name. You are the Lord, O oh God. There is no one who is like you, O oh God. Be thou lifted up on high. Father, we exalt your name. We exalt your name. We exalt your name. We glorify your name. We glorify your name, O God. Ya do po ja ba li pre ke pe za da le pre ko po ja da ba ha. Ya de ke de po ja da li pre ke pe zi ka la pre ko mo sha da ba ha. Father, be thou lifted up on high. Be thou lifted up on high. Be thou glorified, O oh God. Be thou exalted above the stars. You are worthy to be praised, O oh God. You are worthy to be exalted, O oh God. Ya do po jakla preke bezada le preto po jika baha. Ya daga da po jakli preke bezika rika katala bo shale preheda. We say that you are Lord. You are worthy to be praised, O oh God. We say that you are. You deserve all our praises, Jehovah God. You deserve all our praises, my Father. Ya tobo jali preke bezada baha. Ya dobo jada bali preke bezika la preto boja. Ya dege de boja la preke bezika rika katalabosha. You are worthy. You are worthy. You are worthy, O God. You are worthy, Jehovah God. Ya daga da boja da barika balata baza. Raba baba do boja da bariko poloto huga baha. Ya dege de boja da bariko poloto lobo shali preke la talabaha. As KSH, we worship your name, O God. As KSH, we glorify your name, Jehovah God. As KSH, we magnify your name, O God. You deserve the glory. You deserve the glory. You deserve the honor. You deserve it, O God. Ya de boja la breke beza la breko boja da baha. Ya daga da boja da bareko poloto huga li breke beza da baha. Ya do boja le breke beza da bareko poloto lo mo shale breke la taha. Shaka ta boja da bareko poloto huga baha. I want you just to go before the Lord right now. And you say, Father, wash me with your blood. Jehovah God, wash me with your blood. This midnight at this hour, wash me with your blood. May I be purified by your blood, oh God. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Cleanse me, oh God. Wash me, Jehovah. Wash me, oh God. Ya dobo jali breke bezali breke bezada baha. Ya dobo jakla breke bezika bareko polotolo bosha. Wash me, wash me, wash me, wash me, oh God. Wash me with your blood. 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 Purify me with your blood, oh God. Cleanse me with your blood. Jesus Christ. Wash me with your blood. 
Yande boja kade baha raba bado boja le breke bezada bareko poloto hoga yada gada boja da bale breke bezada bareko poloto hoga yada gada boja da bale breke bezada bareko poloto lobo shale breheda wash me wash me wash me wash me wash me oh god wash me with your blood wash me with your blood wash me with your blood cleanse me oh god with your blood purify me jehovah god Ya dobo jakla preke bezada bareko poloto lobo sha ya dagada bojada bali preke bezada bareko poloto lobo sha ya dagada bazika li preke bezada bareko poloto lobo sha ya degete bojada bareko poloto lobo sha li preke la tohoka cleanse me oh god may i be purified oh god may i be purified by your blood may i be purified by your blood May I be cleansed by your blood, O oh God. May I be washed by your blood. Ya dobo jakla breke bezada bareko poloto lobo sha. Ya deke debo jakli breke bezada bareko poloto lobo sha ba. Ya daga debo jabali breke bezali broto bo sha. Your blood, your blood, your blood to purify even the place, the ground that we are in. Your blood to purify. Your blood to purify. Your blood to purify. Ya baba do boja le breke bezada bareko poloto hoga ya daga da boja la breke bezika ri baba do boja ya do boja la breke bezika bareto boja in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus wash me with your blood oh god wash me with your blood jehovah wash me with your blood other thank you lord thank you father ya da boja le breke be Zada baha ya daga da boja da bareko poloto huka barika tala basika li preto boja da bagada basika la preko boja da bareko poloto huka ya dege de boja da bali breke bezada bareko poloto huka ya do boja da bale breke bezada bale breke la tolobosha ya do boja da bagade ge de boja le breke bezika clean breko moshanda bale bro Kolo to huga baha ya dege de boja kla breke bezika ri bebe do bojika indo boja kla breke bezika la tala bosha your blood your blood your blood upon my marriage your blood your blood your blood upon my ministry your blood your blood your blood upon my children your blood your blood your blood upon my family your blood your blood your blood your blood upon my business your blood your blood your blood upon my projects your blood i cover i cover i cover i cover ya do boja di bada bagade boja la breke la ta ri baba do boja da le breko lo tolo o sha le breke la to hoga ya deke de boja da bareko polo to hoga ya deke de boja la breke beza da bareko polo to hoga ya deke de boja da bareko polo to lo o sha le breke la ta ya de boja da ba we worship your name I want you to raise your hands up on high worship him we worship your name oh god this midnight we glorify your name oh god this midnight oh god we worship your name jehovah god we worship your name oh god we worship your name jehovah god we worship your name oh god ya de boja da bagada bazada bareke de boja da bareko poloto lo bosha in my life you are worthy to be praised oh god in my life you are worthy to be praised jehovah god in my life you are worthy to be praised jehovah god in my life you are worthy to be praised oh god ya da boja la breke la tala basika re baba do boja da bagada la basika ba li preto boja da bareko poloto huga ba ya deke de boja le breke bezada bareko poloto huga ya do boja da ba li breke bezada ba la breke la tolo bosha ya deke de boja da bareko poloto lo bosha li breke la ta Ya deke de boji kama le breke la tala bosha. Father, we worship your name. We worship your name, O God. We worship your name. We worship your name, Jehovah God. 
we glorify your name jehovah we exalt your name oh god ya tepo shabari kala taba li preto po shada bagata la basika ba lo preto po shada bagate besata gata po shada bareketa la ba li preto po shada bagata la bo shali brekela ta ya do po shada bagate besata bareko poloto huga ba i do po shakli brekela ta la basika i want you just to lost be be lost i want you just to be lost in the presence of the lord i want you right now to lose yourself lose yourself tell him that you are worthy oh god you are worthy jehovah i worship your name for who you are in my life i worship your name for your covering oh god oh this why your protection oh god ya debo ja di badagada bazada bariko poloto uga ya dege debo ja da bariko poloto uga ba ya dege debo ja da bariko poloto lobo shale prekela ta ripando po ja li prekela ta la basiga if it was not for your protection where will i be oh god if it was not for your covering where will i be oh god i worship your name i glorify your name i'm grateful oh father i'm grateful for your covering i'm grateful Je- Oh my God! Ya te boja da gade pesa da bare kopolo to huka ba ha. Ya te ke te boja kla preke pesa da bare kopolo to lo boja. If it was not for your provision, where will I be, Oh God? If it was not for your covering, where will I be, Jesus? I worship your name. I worship your name, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I love you. Jesus Christ I love you Jesus Christ I love you I adore you oh God I worship you until the very end I worship you oh God Ya de boja riba do boja li preke medala la basika ma le preke pesada bare kopolo to huga ya de ge de boja da bare kopolo to lo bo shale pre e da ba you are worthy to be praised oh god you are worthy to be praised oh god you are worthy in my life you are worthy to be praised oh god in my life jehovah i worship your name but i just want you to love your father love him just tell him that lord i adore you some of us will be dead by now some of us will be probably raged right now some of us i don't know where will he be if it was not for his presence i just want you to tell him lord i thank you i'm grateful my father i'm grateful oh god i'm grateful father i'm grateful jehovah god i'm grateful for your protection and your covering i'm grateful oh god yeah de boja le pre ke mendala la basika ba ya de boja la pre ke bezika ribando boja thank you father thank you holy spirit i want you just to raise your hands where you are just raise your hands father we are grateful lord and we love you we thank you for who you are we thank you for who you are we thank you jesus for who you are in our lives Thank you Father we love you that's what we want to say we love you Jesus we love you Father Holy Spirit we love you we adore you oh God Father we worship as we are raising these hands up on high we say that you are the Lord in our lives we say that we will dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of our lives Father thank you in Jesus mighty name amen come on somebody i want you just to clap your hands to the Holy Spirit uh just clap hands to the holy spirit we thank the lord for this wonderful time uh we thank the lord for what the lord is doing uh in our lives i'm really excited with uh the prayer and the fasting day number 26 we are here and the lord is protecting us the lord is covering us uh and i'm i'm really uh grateful i thank the lord i'm really great, great grateful uh, for what the Lord is actually doing. I want you to uh, push on. I want you to press on. Uh, there is something that you are about to get. I want you to press on. I want you to press on. Regardless of the storms. Regardless of the challenges that are coming up. Regardless of the hardships that you are facing. I want you to press on. 
I want you to press on. He who called you will see you through. Listen, I don't want you to feel discouraged. I don't want you to feel downtrodden. I don't want you to feel, uh, you know, useless. I don't want you to blame yourself. I don't want you to condemn yourself. The Lord has forgiven you. The Lord is cleaning your blood. The Lord is washing your blood. The Lord is cleansing your blood. I'm, I'm, I want you to understand this is good news. Uh, listen to me. The reason why the storms are rising, the reason why the hardships, are probably starvation, probably sickness in your body, is because you are touching something. You are touching something. So let it be. Let all these things happen. Let it be. But I want your focus to remain on the word. Your focus to remain uh, in these prayers. Allow me to welcome each and every person that is joining us uh, right now. Uh, we thank the Lord for his grace. We thank the Lord for his power. And uh, please, we want to know where you're connecting us from. Uh, we want to know who you are, where you're connecting us from. Um, by the grace of the Lord, we're celebrating. We thank the Lord. And uh, please, I want you to tell somebody that we are having powerful prayers every midnight until the 31st. Uh, powerful. And uh, please, we are going to have uh, a powerful all-night prayer, the night of vengeance. Uh, that's going to be on the, on the 2nd of February. And uh, I thank the Lord that's going to be my birthday. So we are going to have an all-night prayer. And uh, we are also launching uh, two fish and five loaves of bread, uh, a charity organization uh, that we, we are starting on the 2nd, my wife and I, uh, on the 2nd of February. And uh, we are going to make sure that each and every single day we are feeding 200 people that are living in the, in the, in the streets, homeless people. Uh, and uh, I know the Lord is going to do amazing things. And I want you to be part and parcel of that. Uh, if you want to, uh, to be part and parcel of that, uh, the details are, are on the screen. Uh, you can communicate with us on the number, um, either Mama Gurupira's number or my number. And uh, we are going to actually tell you how best this, uh, we are going to do this. So we are launching uh, two fish and five loaves of bread on the 2nd of February uh, at a, our all-night prayer. So I want you to be ready. There's something good that the Lord is starting to do in our lives. Something great that the Lord is doing. And I'm really excited about that. We thank the Lord. I want us to quickly go into the word of God. The book of Ephesians chapter 6. And uh, remember, before we go into the word of God, we are in the year of uh, generational cleansing of my blood. And uh, what we are praying is the Lord to purify my blood. The Lord to wash my blood. According to Joel chapter 3 verse 21. Lord wash my blood. The mistakes that you have been making. The bad choices that you have been making. All this there is a result of what is in your blood. We are going to talk uh, more about this. But I want you to uh, pay attention. So every time when we are praying and fasting, your main prayer point is, Lord, may my blood be cleansed. Jehovah God, may my blood be cleansed. May my blood be washed. May my blood be purified. Why? We want to get rid of the three people that you are seeing in, the, in that blood. That's you. These three people, whatever the covenants that they entered into. Uh, the decision that they made, the wrong decision that were breaching the law. You, all these things are manifesting in your blood. So if the blood is not cleansed, the manifestations will always come and, and okay in our lives. Uh, so I want you to pay attention to that. Please quickly turn with me in the book of Ephesians chapter, chapter 6 <clears throat> verse 12. These are scriptures that we have been um, uh, actually looking at uh, more often during this period that we have been praying and fasting. Ephesians chapter 6 verse 12, I shall read. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, 
against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. I want to repeat that. For we wrestle not. For we wrestle not. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities. So, there is a battle. There is a warfare in the spirit realm waged against us on a daily basis. There is a battle that is happening right now. Every single day, there is something that the enemy is releasing against your life, against your destiny, against uh, your family, against whatever that concerns you. The, the enemy is releasing missiles. But I don't want you to be bitter in the physical. Because the moment that you, you are unforgiving, the moment that you are angry, you are now fighting against flesh and blood. Not against the real uh, culprits behind this uh, battle. These are principalities, rulers. You look into all this list. These personalities, they are operating in the spirit. Even though the arrows, they manifest in the physical. So if you are not aware, you become bitter. If you are not aware, you become angry. If you are not aware, you are going to, uh, you know, stop things that you were supposed to uh, go on with merely because you are saying this has manifested in the physical. So it's a physical battle. No. Even though the principalities, the powers, the rulers of darkness, they are all using flesh. But when you counter attack in the spirit, that's the beginning. So I want you to understand that as we are talking about how to break an anti-marriage uh, anti seed in our blood. What is it that we are supposed to look at? But before we, we go into that, I want you to quickly go in the book, uh, turn with me in the book of uh, Genesis. Genesis chapter 6. We are talking about spiritual marriages. That's what we are talking about. And it came to pass when men began to multiply on the face of the earth. And daughters were born unto them. That the sons of God saw that the daughters of men that they were fair. And they took them wives of all which they chose. May God bless the reading of his word now. I, I want you to understand something here. What is happening in the, in the physical, it has its roots in the spirit. Please, I want you to understand that. When we are talking about uh, unmarriedness, we are talking about singleness. I'm single, pastor. There's no relationship that is coming. All that, if you look closely, it's in the blood. It is in the blood. Because now from this scripture, we, we have an understanding that spirit beings have the ability to legally marry human beings. I don't want you to, I don't want you to miss that. Remember, I, I was teaching on the previous teachings, I was saying that uh, after God I mean, gave, uh, made everything, the trees, the rivers, all these things, the birds, the cattle, everything. He then created a Adam, a human being. And now, when Adam was aligned to the purpose, to his purpose, when Adam began to, under, began to understand that I am here to take care of the garden, the Bible says, the, the Lord came in the, and he said, it is not good for a man to be alone. Why? God is not doing this for Adam. God is doing this for his creations that Adam is supposed to supervise. So the marriage is coming to maintain or to sustain 
or to stabilize the blessing that the Lord has deposited in the life of Adam. So the enemy knows that as long as the marriage is right, whatever the Lord has poured in Adam, it will be sustained, it will be maintained, it will be long-lasting. Why? Because the marriage is right. That's why you see that when the enemy came, he came through Eve, not Adam, to destabilize what? The marriage. Not because the enemy, I mean the devil, he hated Eve. No. The, the devil did not want the title that Adam had. And he wanted the creation of, the, of God to be destroyed merely because he destabilized the marriage. So the devil is aware that as long as you are married, everything is okay. So that's the reason why there is marital failure in your life. I always preach this. Why? Because I'm not preaching from Bible school. I'm preaching from what I realized, what I observed in my life. The mistakes that I made, things that were repeating themselves in my life. And I began to ask the Holy Spirit, but why is this happening? And that's how these teachings came about. Now, pay attention to this. Once you are married, once marriage is contaminated, Nothing in your life will ever move, even though you're making money, even though you are a CEO, even though you are this and that. You cannot rise up to where God wants you to be because the enemy knows he will just come and shake it off. So what is happening? The enemy introduced spiritual marriages. The sons of God the fallen angels, the daughters of men coming together and whatever the daughters of men were trying to do in the physical, it could not work. Why? Because they are married in the spirit. Please, I want you to understand. As long as you are married in the spirit, there is nothing physical that will be tangible. I'm talking of the blessing of the Lord who will never manifest in your life. Why? Because in the spirit, there is another union. And that union can even prevent the power of the Lord to penetrate. That union can even prevent the grace of the Lord to come upon your life. Because it's a covenant. So now, Pastor, how do I know that uh, there is uh, a spiritual marriage? evil spiritual marriage number one you make same type of mistakes you repeat making wrong decisions especially in the area of relationships you are meeting the same people same type of people if they are drunkards or they abuse Probably they are addicts or they are not faithful. No matter how careful you become, this, the following person come, coming in your life, they will always have the same attributes. And you are asking yourself, but why am I falling? In the same pit. Or else uh, it will be the only people that are coming into your life. They are married people. They are married people. They will try to hide it but they are married. Sooner or later you find out. That this person is living a double life. This person uh, when he's saying I'm going off to work. They are going to see their families. And, and this has been a trait. These are traits. This has been repeating itself over and over and over and over again. So now, what is happening? Remember, whatever that is in the blood controls you or navigates your life. That's the right way to say it. Anything in your blood, it navigates, it controls the navigation system is coming exactly from your blood. So this anti-marriage seed, it was deposited probably from your mother, 
probably from your father probably from your grandfather or your great grandfather and you begin to wonder you begin to wonder why is it my choices are on these types of people why is it so now listen to me i want you to stop blaming yourself i always say this i want you to stop blaming yourself for the mistakes that you've been making bad choices that you made before and i want your focus to be here i want your focus to be now i am building something lord now i know the truth may my blood be washed because if that seed is, remains in your blood you are finished if that sin that seed is still in your blood regardless of your many prayers as long as you are not addressing that particular matter you are doomed these are christians that they're in church and they are wreaking havocs uh, i was given giving a an illustration or an example uh, in church on Sunday of a lady very faithful very faithful she was single and she was trusting the Lord for marriage very faithful seeking the face of the Lord no fornication no adultery and he should ask of the Lord marriage 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 a guy came not from the devil from the lord love the lord fear the lord and uh the guy said come on i'm willing let's do this i've seen how you love the lord i was i've seen your lifestyle you are my wife material lobola was paid and uh the date for the wedding was set. The wedding came powerful. And uh, they went to a hotel for their honeymoon. And the guy uh, received a call. They wanted him urgently at the workplace. And he ran. He went there. Love, I'm coming back. Let me just quickly go. He left. The lady could not explain what happened but when she woke up the husband was standing on the door very destroyed because of what he was looking at on their honeymoon day the woman is sleeping with the waiter that she can't explain what happened never met the waiter before this is the first time how the waiter get, got into the room how this whole thing happened she has no clue and the husband said we are calling it off if you can do it on, at the honeymoon what about after five years how many men are you going to change and this woman cannot explain this there's no amount of speaking because the scene is there we're looking we're looking at what's happening explain yourself are you going to say spiritual no who is going to believe you so what happened if you look go you trace back the mother was like that the lineage from the mother's side was exactly it was single people being pregnant bring the child at home and that's it so this woman she devoted herself to the lord but she never dealt with what is in the blood because what is in the blood can only be removed when you begin to say in the name of jesus you seed of anti-marriage you seed uh, of fornication of a lust of adultery of a spirit husband i command you out of my body 
Jehovah, I open my blood in the name of Jesus Christ. Come in, O oh God, and remove this and wash me. Remember Joel 3.21. For I will cleanse the blood that I have not cleansed before. So you can go to church. And the devil wants you not to touch on that. Actually, the enemy will allow you to uh, uh, go to, to, to churches that are entertainment. They don't look into things like that. You're playing, you're dancing. There's nothing wrong with that. That's beautiful. And, and, and uh, when it's prayer, it's just three minutes prayer and we go home. We eat biscuits and that's it. We go home. The enemy is happy because you are not touching on the fundamentals, the, the, the essential, the most important things. So now listen to me carefully. You're making same mistakes concerning same type of people. Different faces. Same personality. And the reason why they share the same personality because the, the personality we're talking of something that's in the spirit. They represent a spirit husband. They represent the characters of a spirit wife. The characters of a spirit husband. So the reason why they are exactly like that, that is that man in the spirit manifesting in the flesh to keep you in one position. So they're all drug addicts. They all abuse you like nobody's business. They're all doing all these sorts of things. Where are they getting their personality? Which means somebody is releasing these people to you. So a spirit husband always operate with your family altar. I have seen marriages that broke up the day that the woman took the husband to their house. And they said, we don't want this person. They never knew anything about him. About her. But they are angry about the person. They are saying, you, you cannot marry him. You cannot marry her. And you ask, but what is the reason behind? The reason is, this person is not coming from our old. So now, the moment that you, be, you continue with that person, especially if they're prayerful, you are going to break free from the altar. And there are certain, I've seen uh, mothers calling their daughters uh, with uh, surnames of uh, a boyfriend. Probably the boyfriend is even married and the mother is aware of it. And they call, they love the guy. Regardless of his marital status. So now, the altar is comfortable. As long as, remember the spirit husband or the spirit wife does not want anything legal in the, in the spirit. So I want you to have an understanding that those decisions that you were making, I think to, tonight we're just going to touch on that because of our time. That bad decision that you have been making, it was based on what was given to you by what is invisible. I want you to pay attention to the things that are in the spirit. Because the Bible says those ones, they are permanent. What we see in the physical, it is temporal. So your prayer now, this morning, any spiritual marriage covenant in the spirit, I break it. I break it. I break it. Anything that is giving the spirit husband power, the spirit wife power over my life, I break it. Let it be removed. And I want you to make these declarations. I am in a covenant relationship with Jesus and Jesus alone. These teachings from the Holy Spirit, they have transformed my life. So they, they have changed me. Listen, this way that I'm teaching, the points that I'm giving, you will not find it in any theological school. 
the Holy Spirit gave it to me. And I started to apply it on my life. And I've seen great change. I want you to apply it. Number one. Anything called lust in you, remove. Anything called fornication in you, remove. Anything called adultery in you, remove. Anything called bitterness, anger, and forgiveness, remove. And you begin to say, Lord, enter into my blood. Any anti-marriage seed, out. You are delivered. We want to go before the Lord. Your first prayer, I want us to cry before the Lord and we say, Lord, we are sinners. We admit our sins. Jehovah God, I sinned against you. Have mercy upon me. Wash me with your blood. I want you to stand where you are. We are going to speak to our Father. We are going to cry. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Ya dobo jali breke la talabasi kabaha. Roba ba dobo jakla breke bezada ba rekoloto huga. Ya de gobo jada ba li breke bezada ba rekopolo tolobo shabaha. Ya de gede bo jakla breke bezada ba rekopolo tolobo shaha. In the name of Jesus, Father, I am a sinner. Wash me with your blood. I am a sinner. Any unrepented sin in me, O oh God. Right now, I openly say, Father, have mercy upon my life. Forgive me, O oh God. Forgive me, Jehovah God. Forgive me, Jehovah. Forgive me, O God. Ya do bo jada ba libre ke bezada libre to bo jada ba ha. Ya da gada bo jada ba reko bolo tolo bo sha libre ke la talabasika. Wash me with your blood. Wash me with your blood. Wash me with your blood, O God. Wash me with your blood. May I be cleansed by your blood, O God. May I be purified with your blood, Jehovah God. I pray. Ya do bo jada ba reke bezika libre ko mo shada ba ha. Ya do bo ko bo Shika ma libre ke la talabasika libre ke la taha. Wash me, wash me, wash me, wash me, my father. Wash me, wash me, wash me, wash me, wash me, oh God. Ya dagada boja dagade bezada bagada bagala bohu shabaha. Libre to boja da bala breke bezada bareko polo to hoga. Purify my blood, oh God. Purify me, Jehovah God. I pray in the name of Jesus. Purify me, oh God. Ye da boja clean. Libre tebeza da bare kopolo tohuka ya dege de boja da bale breke beza da bare kopolo tolo boja ya dege de boja da bale breke beza da wash me wash me oh God wash me with your blood wash me with your blood wash me with your blood wash me oh God I want you to cry before the Lord just tell him Father this morning may I be purified any sin in my blood any sin oh God I pray ya ta Bojeha, libre ke beza da la preto boja da ba ha. Ya da gada boja, libre ko boja da ba reko polo tohoga. Ya dege de boja da ba reko polo tolo mo sha libre ke la ta ha. I am a sinner, O God. I am a sinner, Jehovah. I run to you, Jesus. I run to you, Jesus Christ. I run to you, Jesus Christ. Ya da boja, libre to boja da ba gada ba zika, libre to boja. Ya do bo go bo shada bare ko polo to huga ya nda gaba la bo ho shaba ha ra ba 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 do bo shada ba gade he gaba ha ri ba 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 do bo shada ba gada gada bo shaba ri ba 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 do bo shada ba raka tala bo sha any impurity in my blood any impurity in my blood any impurity in my blood be washed right now be washed my father let my blood be cleansed let my blood be washed let my blood Blood, according to Joel 3:21, wash my blood, 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 wash my blood. Ya de boja da bagade bezada bareko polo tohoga. Ya da gada boja da libre ke bezada bareko polo tohoga. Ya de gede boja da bali breke bezika rika katala boja. Clean breto mo shanda bagade bezada baha. Ya do boja kla breke bezada bali broko lo tohoga. Ya dobo jada any dirty in my blood, let it be removed. 
I want you to say, Lord, any dirty in my blood, any curse in my blood, any spell in my blood, let it be removed right now. Any dirty, any dirty, any spell in the name of Jesus, let it be removed right now. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, let me be purified. Let my blood, any dirty in my blood, let it take it out, take it out, take it out. Any dirty in my blood, let it be removed. Any dirty, Father, I pray by your power, I pray by your power, I pray by your power. Ya doboja. Ya de boja la breke beza li preto boja da bagada la basika male breko boja wash me with your blood 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 oh god purify me with your blood jehovah purify me with your blood ya de boja la breke beza da li preto bojika ya da gada boja da bareko boloto hogaba li prete beja da bareko boloto hogaba listen to me I want you to pray and you say any evil ring in the spirit. Any evil ring that I am wearing in the spirit, let it be removed right now. Any evil ring that I am wearing in the spirit right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, let it be removed. Where whatever the meaning of the ring is, let it be removed by the power of the Almighty God. Open your mouth. Ya da basha li bada gada boja la breke la taha. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the mighty name of Jesus, I remove any evil ring I'm wearing in the spirit. Let it be removed by the power of the Almighty God. Any evil ring any evil ring any evil ring i'm wearing in the spirit i command it to be taken off right now be removed right now be removed right now be removed right now ya de shabagata boja li breke bezada ba ya do boja kla breke bezada ba riko poloto hoga in the name of jesus you spirit husband you spirit wife i give back your ring i give you back your ring i break this covenant i give you back this ring ma toboja li breke la ta re baba do boja kla breke bezika ya do boja kla breke bezada ba ya daga da boja da bare ko poloto hoga ba ya daga da boja da bare ko poloto hoga li breke bezada la bare ko boja da bare ko poloto hoga ya daga da boja da bare ko poloto hoga ya dege de boja da ba li breke la ta you evil ring i command you out of my life you evil ring be returned wherever you are coming from you evil ring i command you evil wedding ring i break it by the power of the almighty god ya do boja kla break e bezada rika da boja ya do bo boja da bare ko poloto hoga kli break e bezada bare ko poloto hoga in the name of jesus in the name of jesus Ya da baja kla breko loto hoga li breto boja da ba li breke beza kla breto boja da ba la breke la ta ya do boja da ba reko poloto hoga kla breke beji kama li breke la ta la boja re ba ba do boja da ba gata la boja li breke da kla breko mo shanda ba li breke la ta let that ring be removed let that ring be broken let that ring be removed in the name of Jesus let that ring be removed i command by the power i command i command out of my finger you evil ring you evil ring i break your power i retain it right now in the name of jesus i retain it right now i want you to continue praying i remove it i remove it i remove it let it go back to wherever it came from in the name of jesus you evil ring i command matobo jali brekelata libre tobo jada bagada basika barikolo to in the name of jesus let it get out of my fingers i command i want you to demonstrate it even as you are praying i want you to do like you are removing that ring do like you are removing that ring in the name of jesus i want you to demonstrate it right now right now out of my fingers wherever you are 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 be removed be 
removed, be removed, be removed. Ya dobo jada bagade beza, raba ba dobo jada bagada la basiga, libre dobo jada bagade boja, kla preke beza da bariko bolo tuhuga. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus, you evil ring out of my life. You evil ring wherever you are out of my life. I break your power. I break your power. I break your power. I break your power. Ya dobo jakla breke bezada baha. Ya dobo shika mali breke bezada. Libre to bojada bagada la basika. Kla pre to bojada bariko polo to hoga. Ya dege de bojada kla breke bezada bariko polo to hoga. Ya dobo jada gali breke la talabasika. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus, I command that ring. Let it catch fire wherever it is. Let it catch fire. That ring, I command it to catch fire. In the name of Jesus, I command it to catch fire. Ma tobo shada baha. Libre tobo shada bagada basika. Libre komo shada. Ya dobo gobo shada ba libre kela talabasika. Reba ba dobo shada ba reko polo tohuka. Ya dagada boshika. You evil ring be broken. You evil ring be broken. You Ring, holy ghost fire or to locate wherever that ring is and send it back to wherever it came from in the mighty name of Jesus. If it is generations ago, let it go back there by the power. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, you evil ring, be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken. In the name of Jesus, be broken, be broken, be broken. I command, be broken. Ma tobo shaha, libre tobo shaha, ya dagada bogo bo shaha, higaka talabasika, libre tobo shaha. Out of my blood, out of my blood. Listen to me carefully. I want you to pray. Any covenant. Any marital evil covenant in my blood be broken. And I want you, as you are praying there, you're making a declaration that you are joined together with Christ. I am bought with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. Any covenant in my blood, evil marriage covenant, I break your power. As you pray. I break your power in the name of Jesus. I break your power. This is how you're going to pray. I break your power in the name of Jesus Christ. Yeda Bosha, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Yado Bosha Clara, Yada Gada Bazali, Brekela Talabaha, Roba Bado Bosha da Bareko Polo Tohuka, Yada Gada Bosha da Bali Brekebeza da Baha, Reba Bado Bosha da Bali Brekela Talabo Shale Prohuda, Yada Gada Bosha da Bareko Polo Tohuka Baha, Ribe do Bosha da Bali Brekela Talabo Shale Prokolo Tohuka. In the name of Jesus, you evil covenant in my blood. You evil covenant in my blood. You evil covenant in my blood. You evil marital covenant in my blood. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Ya da boja kla breke bezada. Be broken in the mighty name of Jesus. Be broken. Ma to boja da baha. Li breke bezada. Li bre to boja da baha. Ya do go bojika ma li breke la talabasika. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I command. I command. I command. Any evil covenant. Marriage covenant in my blood. Any evil marriage covenant. Be broken by the power. Be broken by the power. Be broken by the power. Be broken. Jada gada boja da bagade beza da bagada boja la preto boja da bali preke beza da bali preke la ta jade ke de boja da bari kopolo tohuka ya da gada boja da bali preke la ta la basika raba baba do boja da bagada la boja li preke la ta ya da gada boja da bari kopolo tohuka ya la ta la boja li preke beza da la preko boja da gada la boja li preke da I break any marital. I break it up. Any marital evil covenant in my 
blood any foreign marriage covenant in my blood be destroyed right now be destroyed right now be destroyed right now be destroyed right now jada dada bosha da bagade besa la preto bosha da bagata la basika li preto bosha ya dagada bosha da bare kopolo to buka ya do bosha da bagata la basika li prekela ta jade gete bosha da bare kopolo to buka ya kata bosha I want, I want you to you continue, continue praying. praying. I'm, I'm breaking, breaking that marriage. marriage. I'm, breaking I'm breaking that evil marriage. marriage. I'm, breaking I'm breaking it in the name of Jesus. Jesus. I'm breaking it in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Ye da bosha kli pre he da ba. Ya do bosha kla pre ke beza da bari koloto hoka. Kla pre ko mosha da bari ko boloto hoka. Ya de ge de bosha da bagada bosha li pre ke la to hoka. Kla pre to bosha da bagada bosha le pre ke la ta. Be broken in the mighty name of Jesus. Be broken in the mighty name of Jesus. Be broken in the name of Jesus. You evil covenant in my blood i break your power i break your power i break your power let my blood be washed let my blood be cleansed let my blood be purified let my blood be washed ya dagada bosha kla preke beza dala preto bosha ya dagada bosha da barako boloto buka kla preke mesha da bali preke la tolo bosha ya de bahi dagada boje kali preke la ta ya do bosha kla preke bezi kari kagata la basika kla preko mosha da bare ko bolo to hoka yi do bo jacla breke bezali breke la to hoka be broken 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 you you evil covenant i command you evil covenant ya da bo jacla breke bezali breke beja kla breko mo shanda ba li breke bezada li breto bo ja ya de ke de bo ja da bare ko bolo to hoka you you evil covenant be broken be broken you you evil you cover me be broken i command be broken out of my life you marriage covenant in my blood your time is expired let the blood of jesus remove by faith let the blood of jesus remove by faith let the blood of jesus remove by faith jada gada boja jada gada boja jada gada boja jada gada boja la breke pesa ya do poko boja da bali breke la tosh Listen to me. I want you to pray right now. Father, this midnight, let the blood of Jesus erase every stain of iniquity in my life, in my blood. Father, in the name of Jesus, this midnight, at this time, any stain of iniquity, any stain of iniquities, any stain of transgressions, any stain of sins in my blood let the blood of the lamb erase open your mouth open your mouth erase my father erase with your blood the blood of the lamb that washes all sins let the blood enter into my blood and remove any stain any stain let it be removed let my blood be purified let my blood be cleansed let my blood be washed any stain of transgressions any stain of iniquities of sins jehovah i pray yeda boja ya degete boja la preke pesa ya do boja la preke pesi kari bebe do boja ya do boko boja la preke la talabasika let my blood be washed let my blood be purified let my blood be cleansed oh god let my blood be purified this morning any stain of iniquities any stain of transgressions any stain of sins in my life let the blood of the lamb remove let the blood of Jesus Jesus remove let the blood of the lamb cleanse oh god let the blood of jesus purify ya baba do boja da bagade beza da baha ra baba do boja da libre ko boja da ba libre ke la ta ro baba do boja da ba libre ke la ta la basika ro baba do boja da ba libre ke la to lo boja re baba do boji ka ma libre ke bezika wash me oh god wash me with your blood wash me with your blood wash my sins with your blood wash my blood with your blood cleanse me oh god purify me oh god 
da da boja da baga de bege de boja ri ba 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 do boja da baga da la boja libre ke la ta ri ba 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 do boja da baga da la basika libre to boja ri ba do boja da baga da la basika libre to boja ya do bogo boja ka ma libre ke pesada your blood your blood your blood purify me oh god i detach i disconnect from my blood my 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 father's blood i disconnect from my mother's blood i disconnect oh god i disconnect jehovah i disconnect oh god let my blood be from you jesus let my blood be from you jesus let my blood be from you jesus ya de boja la preke pesa da libre to boja da ba ya da gada boja da libre ke pesi kari kaka tala boja father thank you i want you to raise your hands where you are we are grateful lord the blood of the lamb is washing the blood of jesus is cleansing the blood of jesus is purifying the blood of jesus is washing the blood of the lamb is purifying right now the blood of jesus is purifying right now ya de boja libre ke la tohoga ya de boja ka ma libre ke beza da ba in the name of jesus you are washing this generation oh god you are cleansing this generation oh god you are purifying our generation oh god in the name of jesus christ amen we thank the lord family uh if you feel that you want to you want to give to the ministry uh i want you to raise your right hand the details are on the screen just raise your your right hand father thank you for your grace we we hear you oh god thank you father thank you holy spirit we heard your word and let this word transform us and right now lord every hand that is stretching towards the ministry may they be blessed beyond measure may they be washed beyond measure may they be cleansed beyond measure may they be washed beyond measure in the mighty name of jesus father thank you in jesus mighty name we pray amen love you so much may the dear lord uh, bless you may the dear lord keep you and i want you to be strengthened i want you to be strengthened i want you to love the lord like never before this is pastor tenashe gurupira once again and that we are going to meet may the dear lord bless you may the dear lord continue to keep you until we meet again i want you to have a blessed and a blessed morning god bless you ksh international church brings you life sermons teaching healing and deliverance with pastor tinash and ole guru pira we are KSH International Church.